Good day, everybody. I want to tell you a little story about a little boy named Dallas Hextel. I saw this on the television this morning, and I thought I'd share it with you. This boy, normal birth, normal first six, seven months of childhood, except that he couldn't breastfeed very well, and his mother noticed that he just, just couldn't. He was colicky. You know, nothing big to think about. But at 18 months of age, this young man couldn't walk, couldn't crawl, could only communicate. He couldn't clap. He, he could only communicate through screaming. And it was mostly due to pain and frustration. This couple had tried for three years to have a child. Three years. And they were flabbergasted at what to do. He was uh, diagnosed with cerebral palsy. What to do? Well, this mother, thinking, before her baby was born, went to a, a place that was on the internet that said they saved cord blood that has stem cells in it. And uh, $2,000 to do it and $120 a year to store it. And they did it, thinking maybe. Maybe we'll have to use it, maybe we won't, we'll see. Because you try, try three years for a child, it might be the only one you get. So they go to Duke Medical Center. And uh, they use an IV and put, it, put these stem cells into this baby's body. Five days later, five days later, the kid starts coming around quickly, talking, smiling, clapping. Didn't take long for him to uh, start standing up and acting like a regular 18-month-old kid. Can you imagine? Because that mother had the foresight to know that this may work if I need it to. That she saved the stem cells that are in the umbilical cord to help her child. There's no cure for cerebral palsy, by the way. And the procedure was, was experimental. But... Does it hold promise? Yes, it does. I wish I'd have thought of such a thing when my children were born. Two grand to hang on to it. Two grand to make it. $120 years a year to hang on to it in case it's ever needed. You see anything wrong with that? I don't. Give me your opinions on it. As for me, thank you, Jesus, for healing this boy, for giving his mom the brains to do this. God bless him.